Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. Welcome back to another video. And today I wanna to talk about how the test server is and was on Xbox for PUBG. Now, uh, in case you guys don't know, they're adding the desert map Miramur to PUBG on the Xbox. And I have a bunch of mixed feelings about this. So first of all, with Murmur, it was on the PC. I hate this. I think that if you're going to bring a console game to, or a PC game to console, or a console game to PC, if you leave content out, I think that it shows that you don't care, and it really stains the reputation for developers on me. This happened with Payday 2, okay, and Minecraft. I really think that Murmur should have been on in PUBG in the beginning. And I, I'm, I'm really, you know, I think that this game is dying out fast. You can kind of tell on the Xbox. It's kind of dying with me, personally. And I, I just wish that it got the love that the PC PUBG gets. So enough about that. Let's talk about the test servers. The immediate thing that popped out to me with the test server was... Do you guys remember all the rendering glitches that happened when PUBG first came out on Xbox? This server does the same thing. And so I don't understand why. And I don't, I, I just don't understand why it doesn't render in as good as the other map. I think that first, you know, the de developers should have made sure that the game rendered in all the way. And definitely hindered my enjoyment of the new map. But other than that, literally the rendering issues and the fact it was on one server not regions. So a lot of times, like, I would shoot someone with a shotgun. They would take, you know, and I'd shoot them, like, a couple times. They would die. I actually absorbed a shotgun blast point blank. It took no damage. Me. I did it. Because we we're on one server. So they, they're, they're, the servers aren't on regions. So be aware that there is bullet absorbing abundant in this game. However... This is a big however. With bullet absorbing and the game not rendering in, everything else works amazing. This test server is very good. This new map is very good. It works wonderfully. And I really am hoping that whatever rendering issue it is with the new map, they fix it. What they had to do on the main map. I don't know the main map's name, the map with Pachinki, you know, the grassy one in Russia. What they had to do to it to make it work was lower the quality of textures. And I really think they should do that with this map. Because, like, honestly, like, I never, this is a couple things. I never got to experience a Hacienda battle because the, it took literally 30 seconds to a minute to render in the stuff and I wouldn't get stuck in anything. Um, the loot spawns are awesome. It just feels... The way that it runs on Xbox right now is amazing. Once um, once the um, stuff is rendered in, the game runs amazing. It's just fun on Xbox. But what this feels like with this new map is it does not feel like they're adding it. It really feels like it's a missing feature. And I just made a video about missing features in Battlefront 2. This game is the same way. I say this about this game all the time. And this, this test server kind of proves it. I am ashamed of PUBG being on Xbox the way it is. I love my Xbox. I love my platform. I'm ashamed that this is the game that is selling with my Xboxes. You know, I feel like it's, you know, my Xboxes, my Microsoft Xboxes. But with these developmental issues, I'm afraid that this test, this test server with the missing features, they have a test server to a game that's in early access. I feel like this test server opens up the gate to have the early access crap that Steam suffers from, I feel like this opens the gates to put it on Xbox. 
and I, I just, I just feel like Xbox is gonna go downhill because of this game, and the the test server really shows it that the you know they can just the the thing doesn't render in right, and you know that's broken, and I get that it's a test server, but if if your issue with your game is that it doesn't render in the stuff you can play, I mean. Why can't they just render it in as gray? I don't understand why they can't render it in as gray boxes and put the textures on them. Like, you know? Like, if it, if it's the physical part of it, I understand. But what makes me even more afraid is when Call of Duty comes out and Battlefield and Red Dead 2, they all are going to have Battle Royale modes. PUBG on Xbox is going to go down the drain if these games, if one of these games releases a working version of Battle Royale and literally copied PUBG, but it works, PUBG is done. That's what this test server showed. So, let me know what you think in the comments below. I can't wait till this new map comes out on Xbox. It was a lot of fun. Um, do you think that I'm just being a crazy dude with a sign saying the world's going to end. It feels like it. But I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck. Oh, God, I'm coughing. I suck just as bad as you do at video games, and I'll see you next episode of Stream Blog or Steam It Post of whatever I decide to make.